Miami police officers about to lose their jobs and possibly their freedom. They are under arrest tonight, accused in an elaborate scheme to take bribes in exchange for protecting criminals. CBS 4's Hank Tester is live for us at Miami Police Headquarters with the troubling details here, Hank. Well, there's only one huge problem for these three cops. Those criminals that they were dealing with, they were the feds. The Miami police chief had talked to the FBI, said, I got a problem. I need you guys to take care of this. And they did. Let's take a look. I don't have no comment. I don't know nothing about it myself. Oh, you don't? No, I don't. Okay. Have you talked to him at all? No. His son, Calvin Harris, is a Miami police officer and is in big trouble. Sometimes we have bad seeds in law enforcement. The U.S. attorney says veteran officer Kelvin Harris and officer James Archibald were recruited by officer Shantone Harris. They reportedly took payments to protect individuals involved with money laundering and narcotics trafficking. The FBI credits Miami police chief George Colina for alerting the FBI about possible corruption. The feds launched an investigation, set up a sting operation. The three cops thought they were escorting and delivering illegal drugs for traffickers. They were not. It was an FBI sting, all caught on video and audio, detailed in an extensive federal complaint. We went to Officer Shantone Harris's home. Neighbors and family members avoided our camera but told us they were in shock. She's a great lady, one neighbor said. Shantone Harris sold a City of Miami police uniform and badge to an uncover agent in exchange for $1,500, knowing that that uniform and badge would be used by a hitman to kill off somebody who violated this drug trafficker's trust. The complaint says that Shantone Harris received $17,000 worth of bribes and also used and dealt narcotics while on the job. If anyone believes that they can work here and wear this uniform and, and break the law and get away with it, you know, that, that's not the case. We will out you. You will be found out and we will hold you accountable. Now, how serious is this for these cops? They could be serving life sentences, and they will be in magistrate court, federal court. That's tomorrow. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News Tonight. Back to you.